Cyber hacking, a major source of friction between the U.S. and China. And it's not often, if ever, that a Chinese hacker is willing to talk about what he does and why he does it all on camera. Yunus Yun has our story tonight from Shenzhen, China. From his office in southern China, this former military officer, who would only tell us his code name Prince, says he heads a 5,000-person team known as the Hunker Union, or Red Hackers. I decided to learn hacking skills after my computer was hacked, he said. After I retired from the army, I thought I could use my skills to continue to serve and love my country. I chose to be a Red Hacker, to be the personification of justice. China's hackers are a source of friction between Washington and Beijing. Alleged cyber attacks from China have angered the U.S., which has blocked business deals for Chinese companies and is now considering sanctions on those suspected of engaging in commercial cyber theft. The hackers say that they work from all over the country, but they tend to cluster in high-tech areas like Shenzhen. This city is home to the country's biggest electronics market and is China's Silicon Valley. Prince denies his group has targeted U.S. companies, though he says they have attacked commercial organizations in regional rival Japan. Prince showed me one way he hacks today into a local hospital. He finds an email. Based on the security question, he guesses passwords, like the hospital address. By the third try, we're in the system in less than five minutes. We're now able to gather more information, email, phone numbers, fax, he says. Prince says for attacks, the hackers act on their own, but that occasionally they're called on by the government to help track those believed to be working against the state. The Chinese government says it doesn't support hacking activities and we couldn't verify his claims. I independently have some cooperation with the Chinese government, but it's all off the record, he says. The government normally asks me to follow the electronic footprint of different hackers, gather information on hackers, and ultimately submit official reports. For the country, he vows to protect. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Eunice Yoon.